let's be real. When people are so-called tired of a champ, I don't want you in hiding, talking this trash. I want you to say it to my face. But you won't say it to my face because you know my mentality. You know that I'm gonna absorb that. I'm gonna embrace that. And I know how to use that fuel better than they do. I hear the same shit every year. You think you can defeat me? And then when you turn around and you're under the same roof and you're watching the show and you ask any of the other athletes, you ask any of the other previous champions, who should win the show? And everybody's saying Phil Heath, it's not even close. But then when people online try to pick him apart, you can do whatever you want online. Anybody can turn around and freeze frame a shot and do this and do that. But if you asked anybody that was there, they would tell you the same thing. It was dominantly Phil. See, I treat life like a leg day. Who wants to train arms with Phil Heath? People line up around the corner. Chest, two lines around the corner. Legs, I don't know. I've battled the best. I've beaten the best. And I've beaten them every year since. That's called staying power. That's called grit, determination. Cause you gotta lift that weight. You gotta eat those meals. You gotta do that damn cardio. Some of y'all dumbasses thought my weight was gonna be fucked up this year. Ooh, y'all in for a big surprise. Start acting like you could win this. Changed his mental set, came out, smashed it like a machine. He just like turned into a Terminator, literally. It was like flipping a switch. And that's when the Phil Heath that could have been really became. Whatever your craft is, to be the best at it, you have to want that more than anything. Expect me to win, too and I'm gonna win graciously, and I'm gonna win with a fabulous physique because that's what I worked my ass off for.